trying to put my wig on I got as far as putting on my cap and then um, I just put the wig on with the hat because my lift is gonna be here any minute and I don't want to rush putting it on I want to actually like take my time and put it on right so I can leave it on for a couple days so um, getting ready to head out I'm debating on if I'm gonna bring my computer but I don't think I am I think I'm gonna just um, yeah, I'm not going to bring it. I think I'm going to just bring my headphones. I should have been charging them, but I'm going to bring my charger for it in case I do decide to wait for Sean. All right, let me go because I don't want to have the lift guy waiting. 12 hours? 11 hours. Yeah, 13 hours. Eight okay. nights. Two nights. Okay. Well, I'm going to go thinking about doing it at one point but I don't like the fact that you don't know where you're going mm. until you pick up the person yeah, yeah 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 because my friend she um she got a lift one time and she ended up in New Jersey and I'm like oh my gosh if I'm not prepared to go to New Jersey you know yeah yeah I kind of want to know where I'm going before I get yeah. on <laughs> you don't know but yeah you, you don't know you pick up yeah and after that on the Uber, you know it is at the top. The oh, top Uber of tells you. Yeah, at the, no, no, when you uh, pick up. Okay. At the top, it is coming where you drop off. Oh, okay. But the left, you just follow GPS. You just follow GPS. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're going to... Um... But long thread, they tell you. When it is long thread, the request come to your phone. It, it, oh, it tells tell you? you? It will tell you it is long thread. Oh, okay. Yeah. But the shorter, no, when it is more than 45 minutes, okay, it will tell you more than 45 minutes. It'll tell you, yeah. okay. Well, then that's not bad. Yeah, it's good. But you don't know where is the customer is going. I was going to schedule another one to come back, but I'm not sure what time my appointment is going to be over. Yeah, the, the next one is easy because on that time everyone is in downtown. Yeah. Yeah. Hi right, y'all, I just left my doctor's appointment and I got a rotisserie chicken panini. It's so good. We have sweet tea and some sun chips. Eat. It's like 2 40, so I'm gonna try to wait for Sean. But I'll let you guys know about my appointment after I'm done eating. So, thought I'd come here and give y'all something different than a hair bonnet. But I took my wig off and uh, don't really feel like um, going it right now. I feel like that could be a task for me to do tomorrow. Where's my phone? So, yeah, I'm getting ready to go down. Sean's about to go play basketball. I'm just heating up something real quick to eat. And the baby look at my booper. Look at my booper. Hey booboo. Say hi to the vlog. Say hi booboo. Look at those cheeks y'all. Don't she look just like me y'all? I know. Yeah she does. She looks just like my baby picture. Oh bless you. Thank you. Hey, Arky. Arky. <laughs> anyway, y'all. Y'all know he be arcing my soul. Um, so Kaden's in the bathroom, just getting out of the shower. I'm getting ready to um. Don't forget her water. I won't text me anyway. Alright. So yeah, I'm about to make some bottles. Sorry I didn't vlog a lot. Sean picked me up from my doctor's appointments and then we went to um, the stores because he was trying to find some basketball shoes and went to the mall. But y'all, they don't really have like no real, real basketball shoes. Everything is for fashion. So, 
can't find it. But he about to go play ball. And that's it. He didn't see if the chili went bad or not, y'all. So y'all know I cooked the chili last night. I left it out on top of the stove. My mom said when she took the top off, it stunk up the place. I stuck my head down in there and it didn't stink. But I'm not sure if the chili bad or not, y'all. What y'all think? Y'all think it's bad? Let me know in the comments below if you think it's chili bad. It was vegetable chili. So no meat was in there, just veggies. I don't know if that make a difference, but. Yeah, I'm eating um, some pineapples. Love me some fruit, y'all. Y'all know. And ice. Let me update you, y'all. On my appointment. So I had my hair and test. And then I went to go see the ENT specialist. My hair and test came back with um, mild hearing loss. And they said that it may be temporary. More than likely it's temporary. Um, she did see fluid in my right ear. And um, there was a little bit of wax build up in this ear. Which I'm thinking that's the ear that I listened to. Like I used the phone. Because the doctor was so confused. Like your other ear is perfectly clean. I'm not understanding why the other ear isn't as clean so hold on booba so um oh you got it yeah so he cleaned my ear out um both ears and then um they uh basically told me to come back in a month and I have to take Flonase or something like that whatever that is so I gotta pick up that Friday and then the babies um got oh yeah and then he was also saying the tinnitus in my ear which is like the pulse that I hear in my ear to also stem from my low iron he said when you have low iron, your heart beats faster, you're pumping blood a lot, you know, faster or whatever. And it could just be a blood vessel that's close to that eardrum that's making me hear it. But I think it's related to whatever fluid I have in there. Um, he was saying it shouldn't cause an ear infection, but if anything changes symptoms wise or whatever, um, to email him or call the office or whatever. But I'm supposed to follow up in a month. And then the doctor for the baby called at 315 and I was talking to her about the baby having um, like that breathing noise. It sounds like a strider. So she's like <gasps> when she um, breathes or she gets like real excited or she's drinking and then I don't want her to exasperate. So, um, the doctor said that she wants to see her Friday. She'll evaluate her and then determine if we need to put weight in her, um, formula. So, I was very busy, to say the least, which is why I didn't, um, vlog a lot. So, apologies about that. But, yeah, so, <clears throat> that's pretty much it. But I'm hopeful. Waiting for my food to get done. I'm going to go in here and chill talk to my moms. And I'll be back. Alright y'all. So we put a grape. A, what's this? A black grape? Mm -hmm. That's considered? Yeah. Can y'all see that girls? A black grape and see how the juice is coming out. And then giving it to her. She go back to sleep. Yeah probably. Look yeah. at her. Hopefully this will help wing her off the boob. Or just not be so demanding for the boob to pacify. <sighs> so... Just a little taste. Something different. Look at her. Yeah. <laughs> she love it. Look at her, y'all. Boo boo. And then sucking that sleep. And look at her, y'all. Y'all see my chubbies? My cheeks. She has baby acne. A little bit. She's so impatient. <laughs> No. 
when she about to go to sleep. Yes, okay. She can fall asleep, but still okay. She can wake up and then I'll put her back to sleep probably around 12 30 when she wakes up. Well, I'm gonna wake her up anyway. Let me give her a bath in a minute. I'm gonna text Sean and have him go pick up my keys. Chinks. Chinks. She knocked out, y'all. Mm -hmm. Chinka. <laughs> There's my boo boo. Ring. Ring. I just let her chill in here with the rag on her. I oh, know, nice and warm for the baby. And then mommy gonna let you relax for a little bit and then she's gonna wash you up, okay? And because it's kind of late, it's like nine something, I'm not gonna, um, I'm not gonna wash her hair. Cause I don't want her to get sick. So I'm just gonna wash her up. And then hopefully she had a poop. Hopefully uh, she'll sleep better tonight cause she's been real fussy the last couple nights. But I'm gonna let her chill out and relax a little bit more and I'm gonna lather her up. All right y'all, so she's out of the shower. All dressed and ready for bed. Yeah, so um, she already fed. My mom gave her her bottle. And that's going to be her last bottle for the night. And so what I'm doing is I am saving up my milk supply. Um, cause I'm really trying to wink her off the breast. So I'm just going to go ahead and I usually give her the breast in the middle of the night. Um, when she wakes up because it's just easier for me to just, you know, breastfeed her versus get up, make a bottle, blah, 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 blah. Um, but sometimes if... I don't have a lot of milk supply or she's like really really hungry and um you know my milk supply starts to lessen she'll get very impatient and crying and stuff then i'll just go ahead and make her a bottle so i have a few bottles pre-made already downstairs in the refrigerator and i'm going to um like i said breastfeed her um when she wakes up but she's full now so i'm just gonna Rock her to sleep, sing her a few songs, get her laying down, and then when she wakes up, give her the boob, see how that goes, and if not, give her a bottle and put her back to sleep. Hopefully, she'll sleep throughout the night tonight. Um, it's still kind of early, and when I say early, I mean like early for her as far as like, there's no way she's going to sleep from now until 5 in the morning. So more than likely, um, she's probably going to wake up around 1.30 or so. And then I'll put her back to sleep and she'll probably wake up again um, about 4 or something. So, But as long as she sleeps better than she did last night, I do not have any complaints. Because last night was very, very rough. So. Cross fingers. She sleeps good. You want to say hello to the vlog, boo-boo? Hmm? You want to say hello? No? She's very, very impatient, y'all. Okay. okay. You want to say hello to the vlog? Say hi. Say hi to the jaybirds. Say hello to the jaybirds. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, sorry y'all didn't get to vlog a lot today. Like I said, I was just in and out of doctor's appointments pretty much all day. And then, um, I started to pick up the camera when me and Sean were out looking for some basketball shoes for him. But, I guess he wasn't in the vlogging mood. Even though he normally doesn't vlog, I do. I guess he wasn't in the mood to be vlogged today. So, he was like, yeah, I'm gonna vlog everything. And I'm like, I didn't get no vlog for this today. Like, all we're doing was looking at shoes, whatever. But, he being, you know how he kept the coins. But anyway, say good night. Say good night, boo boo. Oh, I didn't tell y'all. So I took a lift. Y'all know I took a lift to my appointments today, and I got a text message like maybe two hours ago, an hour and a half ago, from Lyft saying that the driver has my car, my keys. I'm so so glad that um he contacted me because I wouldn't have known. Um, that I left my keys in there because Sean picked me up and then when I came home 
I just rang the doorbell and um, Kaden opened the door for me. So I didn't even have to take my keys out or I would have realized that they were missing. So I'm glad that he hit me up and then he just so happens literally to like live and walk in distance from my house. So that was a true blessing that I ended up getting him. So he um, just dropped my keys off to me or whatever. So thank God for that. And thank God for honest people because he could have daggone sure kept my... Um, keys and made his way up to my house since he had my address but y'all look at how she be out out for the count jinx you sleeping you sleeping yeah. now she wants to pass it again huh. she's exhausted y'all you sleeping she been trying to poop and she finally did I don't think it was a lot, but it's better than nothing, so we'll take it. But, clearly she's out, so. So, let me let you guys know how I was bamboozled by Lyft and my Lyft driver out of $15. get a text message from Lyft. Let me see where it says your Lyft driver informed us that he was able to arrange the return of your keys since he made a return um, a trip to return your item you'll see a standard return fee of $15 for his time and effort but let me let you guys know how he is literally in walking distance to my house he's my neighbor and um, I told him that I would come get my keys and he ended up calling and saying oh you don't have to come I'm still out I'm on my way I can drop him off to you and that was because he wanted the $15 whereas I was going to pick them up and like give him like a $5 tip anyway but you're literally my neighbor like you did not have to come to drop those keys off you just wanted $15 and I feel like if I'm going to pay $15 then you should have dropped them damn keys off to me where you dropped me off at you know what I'm saying so that's just annoying like I'm like $15 that's damn near what I paid to get to where I was going you know what I'm saying? For you to just like literally go down the sidewalk from your house to drop me my keys. Like that's annoying. So I just told Sean because he paid for my lift with his card. And I was like, it's, it's going to be another charge. And Sean's like, nah, you need to tell Liv you don't agree with that and let them know. Like he didn't go out his way to drop the keys. He wanted to. You were going to actually pick up your keys. So I don't know. I responded to the message. But... Can y'all see? Y'all probably can't even. Yeah, they don't even. I don't know. It says, if you have further questions or clarifications, please let us know so we can make appropriate adjustments. And I responded like, y'all not telling me how I can get a hold of you guys or anything. So, <sighs> anyway, y'all, just wanted to get on and vent real quick about that. So make sure if you catch a lift ever in life, don't leave nothing in the car. Check behind you. I was just moving fast. Was trying to make it to my appointment because I was running a tad bit late. But whatever it is, what it is, such is life. I want to thank you guys for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed to our channel. And click the bell so you don't miss when we upload another video. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment. Let me know where you're watching from. I know that sounds like a lot, but it literally will only take you a minute if that. And we'll see you in the next video. Good night. Good night. Bye, guys.